Okay, so finally I get to do a video on this build. I've actually been meaning to do a video on this for a while now, and uh, that's because of the Thunder buff. So a couple of months ago, it actually got a 5% damage buff, but not many players paid attention to that. Um, they tend to focus more on like the newer content. Um, and then when we had the nerf to shotguns, uh, the Gust, the Storm, Halo Corona Glory, the Thunder didn't really change that much. It actually got another damage buff, and because the other shotguns got nerfed, it got an indirect buff. So technically it's been buffed three times, but you know no one really talks about it. So uh, yeah, we're going to be running this uh, on the Bulwark. We do have three fortifiers, advanced repair. I am running the legendary pilot as well with the sharpshooter for the Thunder. And uh, we, you know we have energy shield expert, physical shield expert, crazy electrician, tough guy. Um, so this thing is going to be pretty much the ultimate tank, you know, what the Carnage kind of used to be back in the day. I used to uh, run the Carnage Thunder. And then uh, we have the Loki here, we have the Falcon, uh, the Cerberus. I did a video on this, um, I think it was last week. Uh, pretty good build. I still find the Cerberus kind of squishy, but if you happen to miss that video, I'll put a link to that in the top right corner of the screen and the video description. And then we have the uh, Behemoth here with Galatian Exodus. Uh, the kid with uh, the rocket setup, but the main focus is going to be on this build. So I'm going to run a game, and then after that, uh, show you some action clips of this, uh, I'm going to say beast in action, because I've actually had a few games now, and I think a lot of players are surprised at you know how this thing survives. So uh, yeah, let's hop into that game, and let's see how we do with the Bulwark with Thunders. Okay, so we've dropped in on Canyon Map, and I've started with the uh, Cerberus here. I'm not actually sure how this map's gonna work for that bulwark uh, build, but <laughs> I'm just gonna try anyways. Let's see, if we can focus down. I think that's a phantom. He's gone into a phase shift there. We have a couple of players here on this uh, right side. I need to try to see if I can maybe focus uh, these guys down here. Let me just go into a phase shift. Let's focus on this guy. Let's get this guy. Uh, we have three guys on that right side. So when it comes to the bulwark, you don't want to drop it in like um, over here. I'm just trying to think, you know, what am I going to run here? Maybe I'm going to use the Loki. Yeah, this guy's looking on this side. He wanted to... Wait, did I just get hit by a shock train? That guy had a shock train on Amanda and he was attacking me. <laughs> That's kind of weird. I hope this guy doesn't have the pilot. Oh, shoot, he does. <laughs> I'm just staying on this beacon because I don't want this guy to get this uh, beacon here. And I'm probably going to have that phase shift again. I'm going to see if I can actually hit this guy. Get him down to his last stand. And maybe even take him out. There we go. Uh oh. Loki versus Loki action here. I need my uh, rockets to reload. Okay, I got him really good. He's gone into phase shift, which is a good sign. I'm just going to follow him actually. <laughs> Let my rockets... He's running so slow too, I think I'm going to end up killing him here. Yeah, he doesn't look too good right now, other than being a frozen popsicle. There we go. Uh, what does that guy have? So, one thing with the uh, Bulwark, you know, that specific build, you have to be very careful of Aljung's. I think Aljung's is... It's probably worse than, I would say, leeches, because I've taken out a couple of leeches uh, with that uh, bolt. Um, okay, so... What players are on that side? You know what, I'm going to kill my uh, Loki here. We're going to drop in over here with the Bulwark. So the thing with this kind of build, you got to get as close to the enemy as possible. Ah, shoot, this guy's gone into flight. I'm just going to keep my um, my shield up here. Ok, 
Guys, the right side. Oh man, we all dropped in over here. No one went over there. Oh wait, there we go, there we go. That's good, that's good. I need to try to get, uh, you know, to the enemy as close as possible here. Let me just move this way. I'm gonna put that uh, shield up now. This guy's going <laughs> straight for me, but I think he's actually gonna run out of... Yep! So we're gonna do this. I think he underestimated this bulwark. There we go. Yeah, he totally underestimated how strong this thing is. So uh, let's move on over to uh, this side. You know what? I don't even think he busts through my physical shield because I'm looking at my bulwark. I don't see any smoke or anything either. Let's use my uh, shield now. This guy's going to be running out of his ability here soon. There we go. Let's move on over to the uh, center beacon. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Got a couple of players here hitting me. Um, <laughs> not gonna use my shield just yet. I'm gonna use it now. Maybe I can get this guy. There we go. Do I still have a shield? I don't think I have a shield actually. I think it was broken off. This guy got stuck here. I'm gonna see if I can perhaps uh, hit him. There we go. We got a rampage. This guy's gonna get taken out. Uh, we have an Arth over there. <laughs> My bulwark is so busted up. I can see sparks. I wonder if I can see the front of the shield. No, it's definitely broken. I can see smoke. Yep, okay, so... The front of the shield has been broken. I wonder if I can get around to this side. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to bust through this guy's uh, shield here. So, you know, one thing about the, uh, the thunder... One thing about the Thunder, it actually does more damage to the Arthur's physical shield if you compare it to, like, the Glory. So if I can actually break through that, that would be nice. I think he's going to move down below here, actually. Trying to see if I can actually get close here. This guy's going to get this beacon. I'm going to see if I can take care of this guy. His last stand's triggered. Let's just use my shield. Whoa, we got a Titan uh, kill as well. Let's just do this. Oops. My uh, targeting kind of switched on me there. Still alive in this though. <laughs> Maybe I can get this guy. Nope. I'm gonna wait until this guy's ability uh, wears off here. Get him down to his last stand. There we go. No. Okay, so we got this beacon. <laughs> I think that guy's in an now doing. He's kind of waiting for me though. I'm just gonna sacrifice this now because the game's almost over here, and I've been in this bot for the whole game pretty much. Yeah, so he's gone in a flight. I'm gonna use my shield now. Maybe I can get some additional damage to this guy. Before I go down. Get rid of that guy. Let's go for this guy next. 
Where is this guy? I'm gonna see if I can maybe burn him up here. I just realized it's like four versus four. I think I was in that. Uh, <laughs> I think I was in the. Whoa! This guy has, I think, Battleborn on his Fenrir. I think I was in the uh, Bulwark for too long there. No, we have five players, and that should do it, I believe. Here we go. So pretty good run there with the uh, Bulwark. Um, let's take a look to see how we did here in this game. So uh, we ended up uh, doing 2.9 million, uh, 10 kills, 3 beacons. Um, let me take a look at my uh, teammate here. And uh, this guy over here is uh, running the Falling Hanger. I see he's got a Leech Molot here. This is actually very good against the Ao Ming. As long as you keep your distance, um, level 24 Ao Ming. And uh, the other team, let's take a look at what they're running here. This guy is on Android. So this is what he's running and a level 46 Ao Ming. Um, I can't take a look at uh, this guy here. This guy is from uh, iOS. You can always tell because they don't have keys uh, showing. He actually did get keys, but you know, on my end it doesn't show up. Uh, this guy's actually in Master. And I think they're kind of like on the borderline because 5,000 cups is when you hit uh, Champion. Uh, but this is what he's uh, running here. And before we jump into those action clips, uh, let's take a look at the uh, honor points. And uh, there you go. So uh, yeah, we're going to be jumping into some action clips now of the Bulwark Thunder build. And you know, my honest opinion on this build, it's actually not that bad. I've uh, tried it for a couple of games and had some you know, crazy kill streaks in some of them, uh, which you can actually see in the action clips. Um, but um, obviously, you're not going to run this in high level champion. Um, I think it can hold its ground. And in some cases can actually catch a lot of players uh, by surprise because they don't expect like the thunder weapon to do a lot of damage but it actually can be uh, quite devastating if you're not careful but uh yeah that's pretty much it so thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to give this video a thumbs up and if you haven't yet subscribed consider subscribing until the next video i'll catch you guys later totally stole that <laughs> let's put the shield up here um, are we losing a beacon already? I think up top. Okay, we took that guy out. This guy is a blitz. Let's move this way. Oh, brother. A Leo. Let's move this way. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Might be able to take out this Ares, actually. God. Yep, we got a godlike. Got to get behind cover. Whoa! <laughs> Let's just let my uh, shield charge up here. This is where the fortifiers are going to really help. What is this guy in? Uh, this guy's in an... No, this is a Spectre. Oh jeez, oh jeez, ah, <laughs> this guy's got flames too, whoa that was close, let's just let that shield charge up, another godlike, oh jeez, this guy showed up right over here, Maybe I can get another one. Nope. Just wait for it. No. Yes, another godlike. <laughs> Whoa, that's crazy. Uh-oh, uh-oh. That's not what I wanted to see. Put the shield up just to help. Always got to be careful of those Aljungs. 
That's exactly what I wanted. Wanted this guy to uh, fire into the ground there like that. Another god like man, that's crazy. Like this guy, he doesn't notice I'm here. Maybe I can even get maybe I can even get the center. Yeah, he's looking around. He's like, what's going on? Oh man. So the thing with this build is you want to try to get as close as possible. Oh jeez. I'm gonna turn my shield off here just to protect me a bit. The only thing is we gotta watch out for that uh, behemoth. Just heal. Oh man, I took on a lot of damage there. This guy is. This guy should stay near me just in case. I need to charge up my shield here though. Here we go. No. Rampage! Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. This guy's shooting me up here. Maybe I can get close enough. Yes, godlike!